Massive crowd gathers to bid farewell to President Raisi. Final procession begins in Iran. Supreme Leader Khamenei leads the heartfelt farewell. Ayatollah Said Ali Khamenei, the leader of the Islamic Revolution, led prayers over the bodies of President Ibrahim Raisi and his companions in Tehran as millions gathered for their funeral procession. The victims lost their lives in a tragic helicopter crash in East Azerbaijan province. On Wednesday morning, the coffins of the eight crash victims arrived at the University of Tehran, where Khamenei led the prayers. The ceremony was attended by numerous world leaders, president, ambassadors and international figures including Ismail Haniyeh of Hamas and Sheikh Naim Qasim of Lebanese Hezbollah. The massive procession moved from the University of Tehran to the iconic Azadi Square later on. Iranians gathered at the Imam Khomeini Mustala of Tehran on Tuesday night to pay homage to President Raisi and his associates. Earlier, the city of Tabriz and Qom saw millions paying tribute to Raisi on Tuesday morning and evening. Ayatollah Khomeini expressed profound sorrow upon the hearing news of matrodom of President Raisi and his companions. He noted that the incident occurred while Raisi and his team diligently served the Iranian people. The leader emphasized Raisi's tenure both as president and in previous role was marked by relentless effort to serve the nation, the people and Islam. Khamenei lamented the loss of a sincere and a valuable servant of Iranian nation, describing Raisi as a tireless worker who never knew fatigue. At a ceremony in Tabriz, Iranian Interior Minister Ahmad Vadidi also echoed the nation's mourning, highlighting Raisi's popularity and humility. The leader also mourned the loss of the Foreign Minister Abdullayan, who left a legacy of active diplomacy during critical moment of resistance. He also praised the effort of the late governor of East Azerbaijan province and the province's Friday prayer leader expressing hope for a future rise despite the tragic incident. The helicopter carrying Raisi and his entourage crashed on Sunday as it travelled to Tabriz from a broader location where the Iranian president had inaugurated a major dam project. Among the victims were Foreign Minister Hossein Amir Abdullayan, two senior provincial officials, crew members and bodyguards. And so, Iran now awaits to bid goodbye to their contentious yet beloved president. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.